So, I have a lot of clothes. Everyone I know says so anyways. My answer used to be that I do not have too many clothes, I just don't have a big enough closet. But, as I moved to a new apartment, I realized they might be right. I only use about one-fifth of my wardrobe in my everyday life, probably half of it for Instagram photos or special occasions. The rest just sits in my closet, lots of pieces I haven't worn in forever or even thought about wearing. And these are all of my clothes. Seven and a half bags. I did have eight and a half bags, but I did a minor clean out before I moved. Seven and a half bags probably doesn't seem like much, but it takes up a lot of space. So, one of the first things I did once we moved in was to sort all of my clothes. I tend to get really attached to them and I often keep stuff because I keep thinking things like I can make this work or I'll start using this more often or I will keep it just because it's cute and in case I'm gonna wear it sometime in the future, which usually never happens anyways. But this time I had no mercy. This time I would do a real closet clean out. After going through all of my clothes, this is the pile I'm left with. I went from seven and a half bags to four bags, which is really good and I'm really proud of myself. I will go through all of these and try most of them on on camera, but first, my criteria. This is hard, I have to be honest with myself. When trying things on, I have to ask myself, have I used this in some way in the past six months? Am I likely to use it in the future? Does it fit me properly? If not, can I tailor it to fit me properly? Does it complement my body? Would I feel comfortable if I were to wear this outside my house? Does it work with other pieces in my wardrobe? Does it work with my current style? Do I even want this in my wardrobe? If the answer is no on any of these, it has to go. Pieces I never wear. These are the pieces I haven't worn in the past six months or at all. I probably won't be using them for Instagram photos either, so they're just taking up space at this point. Pieces I could tailor to fit me properly. These are some of the pieces that could fit me better if I had tailored them. Then I need to ask myself, will I actually do it? If the answer is no, then there's no point in keeping them in my closet. Pieces that do not complement my body or make me feel uncomfortable. I have a lot of ill-fitting clothes. Some are too small, some were impulse purchases, like this green top. What was I thinking? I mean, it's cute, but it's way too small around my shoulders. Pieces that do not work with my current style. I used to have a more classic style. My basic look was usually some dress pants and a shirt or a blouse, but my style has changed and I've barely worn any shirts or blouses like this in years. These are the pieces I just don't want anymore. This is a mix of so many different things. Some of these pieces are actually cute, while others make me question why I bought them in the first place. Some of these I only use as loungewear. 
but I already have way too many clothes that I only use at home, so they have to go. Okay, I'm finished trying on the clothes. This is what I'm actually keeping, and let me tell you, it's not much. I have big plans for this dress. I have barely worn it, but the fit is nice. The fabric is thick, which means it's full baby proof. I'm gonna sew in the waist a tiny bit. The pattern is a bit loud, so I'm going to do something about that as well. I'll probably make a video about it too, so remember to subscribe. Okay, let's move on. I'm giving this dress another chance. It's a nice dress, it looks flattering on me. I actually ended up wearing it for the first time shortly after the cleanout, so that's a good thing. I have never worn this one outside, and I have no idea when or where to wear it either. Except for Halloween. Imagine if I did a witch costume with this. So I'm keeping it for next Halloween, just in case. And in the meantime, maybe I'll find a good reason to wear it. I probably won't. So that was everything I kept. Everything else you saw in this video, it's gone. And I can finally say that I have some extra space in my closet. Okay, but seriously, I have never had this much empty space in my closet before. God knows, I'm probably going to need it. Anyways, thanks for watching, check out my Instagram. I post outfit pics a few times a week. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. And hopefully I'll see you in my next one. Bye!